Hey YouTube, this is Bernie with Dry Creek Homestead. I hope everyone's doing all right today. Uh, so we're getting a bunch of freezing rain today. Uh, the other day it was 60 or 70 degrees and now it's freezing rain outside. So uh, that's the way it goes. Uh, but with that, I wanted to show, our goal with this channel is to show you the good, the bad, and the ugly. And I think that's where a lot of YouTube channels go wrong, or especially on the homesteading side. When they film everything, everything always looks hunky-dory and glamorous. Uh, and it seems like they only share or show their successes. They don't show their failures. So we're going to try to show everything on this. And um, I, so today it's freezing rain, and we had to go out and take care of animals. And I really wanted to film that, but my camera's not waterproof, so I couldn't. Uh, but, you know, that's one of the realities of this life. You have animals, you have to take care of them. And so even though it really sucked to go outside in the freezing rain because it was, you know, it's still going on. And I think we're expecting a quarter inch of ice. We're probably going to lose power because the tree limbs are probably going to come down. It's just the way it is. But we had to go out and take care of those animals. And uh, with that, we had one pig, that little runty pig I showed in one of the other uh, videos that the kids call Charlotte she is sick so we had to bring her in and we put her in a little dog carrier and uh, I hope to be able to bring her through that and we'll keep you updated on that but so we're just trying to show everything uh, and I hope it'll warm back up we already planted onions and so <laughs> they're in the ground already I actually filmed the video but I forgot I filmed the video and so uh, we did not actually post it to YouTube, so we're actually going to hopefully get that up either t late today or tomorrow that we all can see that. Because uh, like I said, we're just trying to film everything and we want to show you the reality of what it would be like if you really had to, to raise and grow your own food without being able to go to the grocery store. Now, like I said, on the produce side, we're only trying to do 50% of our own produce so we're still going to the grocery store and we don't have a milk cow so you know there's all that but so that's what we're we're hoping to show with this video because like I said I think people fall in love with the romanticism of the host homesteading life and then they uh they don't understand the reality of you know sometimes it sucks to be a homesteader just because <laughs> of conditions outside or the things you have to do to reach your goals so anyway so I wanted to show all that, and so we're going to post that onion video so you can sh sh uh, see how that all went. And then uh, just kind of keep you updated, and, and we're going to show everything that we do. And you're going to see our successes and our failures. And so, and hopefully we're hoping for no failures, but I know there's going to be some. And so along the way, and so you'll see all that, and so hopefully you'll be able to see what the reality of, of homesteading is, and not just the hunky doringness i guess is what you would call it so anyway i hope everybody has a good rest of the day and we'll see you in the next video thanks